Hello everyone, welcome back to another episode of Witcher 3 the Wild Hunt. Nearly as nasty as they make him out to be. Blood and wine. Uh, we are going to do a contract today. We are going to uh, do, it's called um, Big Game Hunter. So we're going to, oh, we got to go real far. We got to go talk to somebody. I feel like I'm spoiled with all this um, fast travel. Because a lot of games don't have fast travel. So I feel like I'm spoiled a little bit. <laughs> Um, I was watching some Fallout play today and on Twitch, and I had no idea there was a survival. <laughs> like, I, I had no idea. So I might be looking into that a little bit, um, just because I think it's, you know, more difficult. Oh, it's in the middle of nowhere. Okay. Sweet. There's people here. Hey! Over here! Please! Which guy? This guy? Merchant? Heard you calling. Wanted to talk? I did. For we're neck deep in trouble. Of the spider kind. No. Need a maid with a broom, not a witcher. You fail to understand. These are huge. The size of pigs or dogs. Black and hairy, spewing webs. Mm-hmm. Not talking about spiders then, talking about arachnomorphs. Call them what you will. You must smash the rogues, will you? Those caves would be prime barrel storage were it not for the beasts. Um, we haven't haggled at all in this entire gameplay, so let's. First let's things first, need to talk about my reward. Okay, so. Excuse me. So far, I usually go halfway and see if they'll take it. Let's see how annoyed they get. Not far now. We find ourselves a hair from agreeing. Okay, so he's a little annoyed. So we'll go... Ten? ten I more? knew we would agree terms. <laughs> okay, we got ten more. Arachnomorphs don't look much like bunnies, but they sure breed like them. Best nip the problem in the bud. I'll look into it. Is that how you're supposed to say it? Am I... Is this the one I'm tracking or no? I guess that's not the one I'm tracking. Just a few more legends. You make mountains out of more. Fuck! Fuck. That could be better than fine. I must insist, Count. You'll be much, much the safer with us at your side. Boulder Dash. Okay. Count, if I may, I believe oh, Vilmar's in the right. There's no knowing what lurks in these wilds. Lads, Two I find your concern touching. I do. Yet I've long awaited this day. So, you must forgive me, but I shall go through with it as planned. Ah, it seems my guide has arrived. Greetings. Greetings to you, White Wolf. Uh, I presume you saw my notice? <laughs> Foolish question. You're here, thus you must have seen it. Forgive me, I should introduce myself. Count Belladal, a great admirer of your deeds. Thanks. Not something we witchers hear often. But Count, sir, do you mean to go off with just this witcher? A right hardy fellow he is, no ponce, I'm sure. But your expedition's too risky on the whole. And not taking us with you, pardon my saying it, right daft. You exaggerate, Vilma. I believe I can manage to survive half a day without someone there to wipe me ass in my stead. <laughs> my guards lament, do. witcher, but you must forgive them. Now, to get down to brass tacks, as you've no doubt gleaned from the notice, I've a rather extraordinary proposition for you. I'm a lover, Witcher, of nature. <laughs> a devotee of the wild. And Tucson is home to several species not encountered elsewhere. I'd like you to accompany me on an expedition whose aim is to... Uh, preserve them. <clears throat> ah, yes. Uh, naturally, you'll protect me, should the need arise. My ever-vigilant guards, see, will report any reckless behaviour to my wife if I get so much as a scratch. And then war will be me. Okay. 
I guess I don't really care to need more at this point. Need some details before I can say anything. Where are we going? What am I supposed to do exactly? In the roundest terms, we shall admire the local flora and fauna. And while we do, I might preserve a thing or two. Preserve? Of this device, see? Uh, a parastysomac. It, uh, it captures, uh, likenesses. A parasist of what? It's like a movable megascope, capturing moments, transforming them into illusions based like upon a movie. which I then paint a painting. So, you want me with you, looking at animals and flowers and... Well, that's more or less what it amounts to, yes. Uh, except you will first have to track down the creatures I wish to capture. I know only the very approximate locations of their habitats. Well, and uh, should any oh, trouble arise, it. we'll have your sword at the ready, right? So, agreed? <laughs> Does sound like a job for me. Uh, yeah, let's, I don't know. Doesn't seem hard. Be glad to do something pleasant for a change. Sublime. In that case, here's your map. Huh? Before coming here, I dispatched requests to several local hunters. They located the habitats of the species of interest to me and marked out their ranges on the map. Good thinking. It'll save us some time. Won't need to track. Ready to go? I'm afraid we've to await the morn. Proper light, see? It's very important. In the meantime, be my guest at my fire, sir. In fact, I'd be delighted to hear some tales of Witcher life. Oh dear. <laughs> Maybe he's trying to capture me. Well, the wide and wild world beckons. The light now is perfect. What? How <laughs> Samantha? All right, so I don't know where we are, but we have to go here. <laughs> um, okay, roads. There's a mountain that looks like a donut, and a really old peanut with hair. Okay, I don't know. Only about around. Oh, here's the hair peanut. Um. In between, it's like two lines. Looks like mountains. Is it like by the water? I don't. I don't know. Seems I got the map, so I'll lead. Yay! <laughs> oh Wouldn't no! Wouldn't rather be out here with those guards of yours. <laughs> you just. Let's <laughs> save it. It's deliverance to emerge from their wings. Him. Believe me. They're all the protective, uh, oppressively so. I wish to admire the wildlife, preserve it, not watch them kill it in a fit of misguided fear for my life. What if the wildlife attacks us? Then we shall have no other recourse. I do not wish to be something supper. For you, but as long as they remain calm, we've no need to provoke them. It's, it's of the utmost importance to me, in fact. Okay, no provoking, got it. You want that deer? Um, let's put that beast oil. <sighs> I wish I remember the color. I think it was like one of these. around here. Mountain. Stay close. Mountain. Keep your eyes peeled. Mountain like a I've bear. one request, Witcher. Avoid bloodshed, if at all possible. Okay. I will try. Let's stay away from the bear, huh? Did we get one? Oh, sensors are fine. Sensors. <laughs> oh. Okay. Okay. 
Isn't that where I need to go? To find the panthers? Hear that? Panthers. Frankly, I did not hear a thing. Clearly, your senses are far more acute than mine. I must rely on them. Okay. Do we not go towards them? Okay. Snares. Looks like they were hoping for a bear. Panther got caught instead. Look, a cold. Oh. Will you help the mother? Give it a shot. Gotta calm her first. Okay, can I like undo it? For call witch's heartless. This will put the light out. Dice and Max upset the animals. Better get out of here. Have a bye, Porching. Uh, let's run. Said you share my love what for animals. Okay. I guess that's good. Whew. Got pretty broad interests for a man of the city. I suppose I double in my share of things: wine, nature, painting. I imagine the life of a witcher must be rather more monotonous, with all due respect. It is. Never boring, though. Uh, I, for one, cannot fathom only ever consorting with the same creatures, day in and day out. Got a wife? Oh dear. Oh no. It's those uh, centipedes, giant yeah. underground tunnel burrowers. Make a distinct sound. We can use that to track them. So scared. Okay. I'm so afraid they're gonna like. Hop out and start attacking. Okay. Still following this thing. Is it gonna pop out there? Eat me? Eat me! Okay. Sounds loud and clear here. Must be near the nest. We're here. Well, this vantage point's no good. I shan't capture a good image from here. All right, wait. We'll find you a better spot that's safe, too. Tread lightly. Giant centipedes sense the softest sounds, the lightest vibrations. You wake one up, it wakes up angry. Find a place. The good view of the lair. Okay. How about up here? Seems like a safe spot. Safe, perhaps, but it offers no view whatsoever. Hmm. Fine. We'll keep looking. Ugh. We're really close. How about here? I don't know. Isn't it a bit close? Right. We'll find another spot. I'm going all the way around. I don't care. I want, I want this guy to, like, die. That wouldn't happen under my watch. Here, maybe. Distance seems right. Light's not bad either. Yes. This will work perfectly. Oh, he went around that way. <laughs> Can you lure them out? Give me a minute. Need to think. Vibrations. 
Gotta send some through the ground. I'll try tossing a bomb or casting a sign. And you watch out. Don't get any closer. Let's throw a bomb. Um. Let's see. Bombs, 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 bombs. Um. I don't know. Because why not? Did I not? Okay. Let's go over there. Excellent day for capturing moments. Thank you. Truly magnificent. Can move on now. I think I need to kill them now. Exhilarating. Positively exhilarating. Thank you. I have one more request. Local peacocks performing their mating ritual. I'd love to see that. Apparently, a flock dwells not far from here. We can go. Just don't count on peeping at them while they mate. Season ended a month back. Oh, that's terrible. I so wish to capture their splendorous tails in full bloom. Is there nothing you can do if they prove uneager to present? Perhaps challenge them somehow? Goad them? What did you have in mind? Don't have a tail myself. I'm not likely to sprout one anytime soon. <laughs> My thoughts were more along the lines of Witcher magic. They say you can exert influence over lesser creatures. Uh, yeah, guess I can try. Can't promise you anything, though. Splendid. Consider me contented. Uh, I cannot pinpoint the flock's location, but a hunter I know told me a few likely spots. I'll mark them for you. All right. Let's go find some peacocks. <laughs> He is not very excited. Well, was I supposed to read the map? I can't climb up. I was wondering, why peacocks? My, my daughter is rather fond of them. There will be a treat for her. Are they trying to kill me? We're close. Eyes in the back of your head. Eyes in the back of your head? Oh. A feather from the rump, coated in suet. Cock shed it recently, and the suet's got a distinct scent. Ought to be able to track the flock. A witcher in action. What a treat to watch. Mm-hmm. Where's the stink? Where's the stink? Oh, I see it now. Okay. I hear it. It's to my left. I didn't know they make these sounds. <laughs> oh, there it is. It is hard to see. It's red. Um. Oh, here's another one. Shh. You hear that? They're calling to each other. Fabulous. We're getting close. Shut up, dude. Oh my god. You don't see them. How close do we have to get? Oh, that's lovely. 
Now, if they could just splay the tails. See what I can do. Find a good spot. Ready! Use your magic, Witcher! Okay. Did they do it? Am I too far away? Damn it. Oh, this will be a masterpiece. Smile, please. Giant centipedes. Damn it. Where did they come from? Must have followed us. Get back. Run, birds, ah, run. Get up. Die. Save me. Where? Jesus, the computer did not like this. Do not in my direction. Is it? All over now. Ooh, that was that was tense. I, I believe I've had my fill of excitement for today. <laughs> Oops. I'm trying to put my sword away. What a wonderful adventure. Get everything you wanted? Yes. In that case, time to get back to your camp. Yeah. I did it without killing him. Returning your lord to you, safe and sound. You've our gratitude, master. You see, lads, there was nothing to fear. Thank you, Witcher, for looking after our dear Count. Seems the jaunt did him wonders. Breathed some new life into him. Wait here a moment, Geralt. I have to fetch my coin pouch. Pay my dues. Um. Wait, I wasn't paying attention. Okay. No need to thank me. Glad they have more contracts like this. Counts a wonder, ain't he? It's a sad injustice, the misfortune that's touched the family. Misfortune? Made no mention, did he? Ten years back, his last Clarice is her name. Took a spill off her horse. Been bedridden ever since. Cannot walk of her own. She'd been the life of the house before the calamity. A merry sprite what filled every corner with joy. Count would oft take her out on trips. She loved animals too. Excursions he makes now, or rather, paintings he brings home. There's her only window on the wider world. No. Sorry to make you wait. I was dead chuffed to be able to observe you in action. To confirm for myself there that the tales about you were not exaggerated in the slightest. You showed discipline, reliability, responsibility. <laughs> I dare say you'd make the ideal business associate. That's a shame you've no interest in the wine trade. One day, maybe. Your reward. Use it well. Thanks. Yes, yeah, seven I've one points. One other matter I wish to broach. In a few days' time, Ooh. I shall exhibit my work for some friends, my coterie, so to speak. Would you come by? Um, sure. Why not? Why not? If I'm in the area. Splendid. In that case, I shall see you at my lodgings. I'm staying with a friend while in Tucson, near a village named Francola. I'll be by. See ya. I'm going to save with my hands! Watch your stones! Both male and female Beauclair centipedes are formidable predators. The bees prefer to hunt in packs, yet the author of this extraordinary work was able to capture a lone specimen preparing to attack. Cast your eye on the hunter who, though fully aware of the danger, wears a look of cold determination on his face as he awaits the optimal moment to strike. <laughs> <clears throat> ah, Geralt, you're here. Wonderful. Come, please. Are they painting me in I'm those? I'm delighted to see you. I have a small gift for you, and I shan't let you refuse. 
You are free to sell it, of course. Though I would be honored were you to hang it in your home. Thanks. Oh, cool. Uh, oh, okay. Talked to your guards back at the camp. Told me about Clarissa. Sorry to hear about her accident. Thank you. Kind words that mean a great deal to me. How's Clarissa these days? Probably can't wait for you to get back. <laughs> to get her gifts, you mean? I've dispatched two already. She'll not need to wait for my return. En route home, I mean to pass through Dol Blathana. They say one can see Sylvan's there. Yeah, actually happened to no one. Name's Torque. He can be mean, but for the right fee, he'll do anything you ask. Splendid. I thank you for the hint. Tell him I send my regards. Okay. Good crowd. You got a lot of friends. All of them seem to be fawning over your paintings, too. Oh, when you have as much coin as I do, friends buzz around like flies on fresh meat. And they praise you to high heavens for each trip, burp and sneeze. <laughs> not all are lying sycophants, that's not what I mean. Just most, unfortunately. Why bother? Why even invite them around? I'm a man of enterprise. I must put my trade before any personal hatreds or sympathies. Besides... Uh, Besides? At times, I'll exhibit a completely failed painting just to listen to them twist their tongues into knots trying to find just the right superlatives to lather on smeared rubbish. Naturally, the more intense someone is to get into my good graces, the louder they praise my masterpiece. It's devilish fun, I tell you. All right, thanks for speaking. Nice meeting you. So long now. That's the sound we were waiting for. <laughs> uh, cool. I guess I could put that painting up in my house. Because that usually doesn't happen. Is she high? Maybe. Um, so thanks guys for watching. Um, and we will see you in the next one. We return to traditional values and morals. That is the remedy for Tussos' problems, not two swords.